Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Auto Tutorials by Level Notion Studios. This is Super Sam once again, and in this very episode, I'm going to show you how you can install and use post library thumbnails in Blender 2.82. So let's get started. So quickly, I'm going to show you how you can download the post library thumbnail add-on, go to your browser and then visit this website, gitlab.com. The link will be dropped in the description below, so just check it up. And once you get to the website, you're going to see the, the files for the add-on. You can see post thumbnails and this button right here is the download button. So click on the, the download button and click on zip. So once you click on zip file, it's going to start downloading. You can go to your, your download space on your drive and uh, change the location to wherever you want it to be. So once you've done that in Blender, go to edit, click on edit and then go to preferences, click on the preferences and make sure you are on the add-ons tab. By default, yours could be on any of these tabs, be it viewport, light or anyone you just We'll make sure you are on the add-on the add-on tab and um, you come to install click on install and you have to locate where your add-on is being placed so mine is placed on the desktop blender setup and i have it here post library thumbnail so you just click on this and install the add-on i'm not going to install the add-on because i already have it installed on my own system here so once the add-on has been installed Once you have the add-on installed, you should see something like this post. Okay, so this, this is the list of the post library uh, terminals that I have on my own system here. So, but if you're just installing yours, the checkbox will be empty. All you need to do is just click on the checkbox to check it. Once it is checked, you have the post library installed. So that is how you install the post library terminals add-on. That's the first step. Now, moving to the second step, how we're going to use it. Firstly, I want to show you the poses I have in here. This is the scene. Okay, I think I should uh, take this off so everything moves faster. All right, so I have a simple scene here with uh, a male character with uh, on a date, yeah? The male character on the date. And, excuse me? I saved uh, three different poses from this. I'm going to show you what they all look like. So selecting all these, I'm going to click on uh, chill pose one. You can see what that looks like. Okay. Then chill pose two looks like this. Chill pose three looks like this. So if you want to know how to create these uh, poses, you can check one of our how to tutorials on uh, post library. The link would also be dropped in the description below. So do want to check it out. Also, I created uh, thumbnails for each of these poses and I saved them in my texture folder within the project folder. So you have post one, you have post two, and then you have post three. And the dimension for this is a square. 256 pixels each so let's go back to the the blender project and this is how you create your thumbnail so once you have your thumb, your your post library thumbnail installed just click on thumbnail creation and as soon as you click on thumbnail creation you have other options here now the first one here is add so now i want to add a thumbnail for chill pose one so i'm going to click on add and then i'm going to browse the directory to my texture folder where i have the images so i have the textures folder here my images are in there and i need the image for chill pose one so i'm going to click on this and add the thumbnail so for chill pose one i have this thumbnail now i want to do the same thing for pose two you can see this 
Chill Post 1. Okay, so for Post 2, click on Post 2 and then click on the Add button also and double click on the Chill Post 2 to add the image to it. So I have that for Chill Post 2 and also for 3, I'm going to add and then double click on Chill Post 3. So the image Post 1, Post 2, Post 3 have been uh, rightfully attached to each of these uh, thumbnails, each of these uh, poses in the post library. So how do I see my images? Very simple, just come here and click on it and then you can see all the three poses that you've created. So if I want uh, this information for my character, all I need to do is just click on Chill Post 3 and once I do this, you can see the feedback updates immediately. And if I want to change the post to that of uh, Chill Post 1, it's simple, I'll just click on Chill Post 1 and you can see it updated immediately. So this is going to make your work faster and seamless. Okay, as you can see. By the way, I I had to uh, take out the polygon. I had to review the polygon air for this character in order to make my my playback speed work faster. So guys, I hope you've learned one or two things from from this uh, video. This is how you can effectively use your post library with thumbnails. Don't forget to uh, like the video, subscribe to our channel if you've not done so, and until next time, keep your creativity blending.